Hello and thank you for purchasing a Wi-Fi enabled Epson printer. This video shows you how to connect your Wi-Fi enabled Epson printer to a wireless network. Before you start, there are a few things you will need to check. Do you already have a wireless network? Do you know your wireless network name, also called SSID? If you have wireless security turned on, do you know your wireless password? If you do not have this information, please ask the person who set up your wireless network. You may also find the wireless security settings on the back of your router or modem. If you answered yes to all of the items in the checklist, you will be able to connect your printer to your wireless network. You are now ready to start the installation. Please connect your printer to a power supply and turn the printer on. Please check the two lights above the LED labelled Wi-Fi are turned off. If the two lights are on, turn off your printer. Once powered down, press and hold the power on button and the button marked with the letter I for about 5 seconds and wait until the LEDs turn off. We recommend you download the latest software for your printer from www.epson.co.uk. In the upper right search box, enter the name of your printer, for example WF-7015, and click the search button. In the next window, click the Inkjet Printers link and select the correct model. In the new window, click the Support and Downloads tab you may need to scroll down. Locate the Epson Network software and driver package and click the download button. You may need to expand the driver and software section to locate the software. Once the file has been downloaded to your computer, locate the file and then open the file. Next, double click the Install Navi icon to start the installation process. If you see a security warning message, close the file and then whilst holding down the control button on your keyboard, click the Install Navi or Web Installer icon and select Open. Click the Open button on the security alert message to start the installation process. If presented with a password request box, please enter your user password. Please read the license agreement. If you agree to the license, select the agree button and press the next button. Make sure both Epson Drive and Utilities and Epson Network Utilities are selected and click the install button. After a few minutes and when asked to, choose Wi-Fi or Ethernet network connection and then select Yes First Time Setup and finally select Wi-Fi slash Network Connection and press Next. Now select Wi-Fi Auto Connect. If prompted, click the Open button on the Security Alert message and then the Next button. If asked to, please insert the admin user and password to allow the installation to proceed. At this stage, press and hold the Wi-Fi button on the printer panel until the green and orange LEDs start to flash. The printer will start searching for your wireless network. If your network supports DHCP, leave the recommended selection, otherwise choose Select IP Address Manually and press Next. The printer is now connected to the Wi-Fi network as you'll notice from the green steady light. Now press the finish button. If your printer does not appear on the list, press the plus sign and select your printer. To test the functionality, we first insert paper into the printer's rear paper feed or paper tray and then click on options and supplies, utility and then print test page. Thank you for choosing Epson. 
Further support and contact information can be found at www.epson.co.uk.